Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, new section, hotties of the gram. Uh, spicing it up a little bit. What an absolute dump truck of a booty that is. Uh, so having a ride today at a new spot. Um, just storing it in the soft stuff. Very good. Uh, this sand is insanely soft. It's uh, like really fine grained sand. Um, yeah, the Fitbit numbers were absolutely off the chart uh, riding on that sand. Um, calories burned was over 500 and um, probably it was only on that soft sand for 20, 20 minutes max. Um, so I thought I'd do a carry on of the, the news. I was doing motocross news uh, the other day. Um, I only got halfway through the bulletin. Um, so the next section is uh, talking about Red Bull KDM team. Um, so Cooper Webb, Marvin Muskan uh, remain with KDM. Uh, so the two 450 veteran riders will remain on the orange bikes going into the 2021 Supercross season. With it being his last year on his current contract, it is uncertain how much longer Marvin wants to continue to race. Uh, Jawsy's happy to take his spot if he wants to uh, relinquish. Uh, so with a pretty good performance in the recent outdoors season, we have a feeling he still has some fight left in him. Cooper Webb, on the other hand, has lent himself a comfortable contract team after winning the Supercross 450 championship in 2019. Uh, also with the Troy Lee Designs team switching from KDM to Gas Gas, uh, that left a factory KDM void in the 250 class. So KDM will take their 250 program back under the Red Bull KDM wing. The 17 year old KDM amateur rider Max Voland, son of former Factory AMA and MXGP racer Talon Volan will fill that spot. Don't know who Talon Volan is. Um, you can read about him on uh, the Motocross Action interview on the Motocross Action Mag website. Uh, so Rockstar Energy Husqvarna, sorry, Husqvarna. That's the correct way to pronounce it. I've been saying it wrong forever. So the Rockstar Energy Husqvarna factory racing team will see a full roster return for the Rockstar Energy Husqvarna Husqvarna factory team featuring Dean Wilson, Zach Osborne and Jason Anderson. All three have confirmed that they will be racing for the factory team in 21. In the 250 class, we will expect to see Hampshire and Swole back under the tent. While there are many rumours of Michael Mosman being transferred to the Red Bull Troy Lee Designs Gas Gas team. Uh, so the 450 class for Rockstar will be Dean Wilson, Zach Osborne, and Jason Anderson. They're all confirmed. And the 250 class. Michael Mosman going to TLD Gas Gas. RJ Hampshire, unconfirmed, but in, he's expected. And Yelex Swole is also unconfirmed, but expected. Uh, what is exciting about the Team for 21 is the addition of Joey Savaggi. Joey was seen on the Moto Concept CRF 450 not too long ago. But when the team was announced, he wasn't on the, ro the roster. We are glad that Joey found a home for the 21 season. He has lots of potential, and he hasn't had the chance to show what he can do. The stylist Justin Bogle will be returning on the team as well. So just to reiterate, uh, Joey Savacci and Justin Bogle are both confirmed for the Rocky Mountain team in 2021. Uh, so the Club MX Yamaha team, uh, they hosted Josh Hill, Enzo Lopes, Lopez, Joey Crown, and Josh Osby during the 2020 Supercross season. Now for 21, they picked up Garrett Marchbanks. They re-signed Joey Crown, and they also hired on Jace Owen. So the Club MX Yamaha team 
Garrett Marchbanks confirmed, Joey Crown and Jason Owen confirmed. Uh, so the Smart Top, Bullfrog, Spars, Moto Concepts, Honda team. Uh, so Malcolm Stewart has moved to Star Yamaha. But MX, but Motocross Action spot Benny Bloss out testing the Moto Concepts bike recently. And Justin Hill told us a week ago that he had some details to work on his Moto Concept contract. The big surprise hiring is Shane McElrath, who is forced by the 250 rules to move to the 450 class for the, 2020, the 2021 season. He will be switching to the 2021 Honda CRF 450 as a teammate of Justin Hill, Benny Bloss, and longtime Moto concept rider Vince Fries. The four man team will all be riding the all new 21 CRF 450 machine. So the 450 class, Justin Hill, Vince Freezy, Shane McElrath and Benny Bloss are all confirmed. Uh, so Team Honda HRC, uh, 21 Supercross team has already been confirmed for quite a while now. It's both Ken Roxon and Chase Sexton have already signed multi-year deals with the team. The two will be racing on the all new 21 Sierra 450. Justin Brayton has stated on Instagram he will sign with the Australian based Penrite Honda team for 21. So the Honda HLC team has confirmed Ken Roxon and Chase Sexton. Uh, so the Tedder Racing KDM team, Martin Davalos is already riding Supercross again on his Tedder Racing KDM. Um, so they have confirmed Davalos and Dakota Tedder. Can he, Dakota Ted is confirmed to be on the team, unsure if he will be healthy enough to race. Okay, so that pretty much wraps it up for the day. Um, we've got one, one last treat, uh, one more hottie of the gram. My god, does it get any better than that. Alright, that's it for me, I'll see you guys in the next one.